Oh, hello. Am I crazy? I've got two hungry bats down my shirt. I suffered pretty severely from anxiety and panic attacks. I felt like I was not able to function at all. I wasn't able to leave the house and I was hospitalised twice. Good girl. <laughs> I joined a volunteer rescue organisation. The bats gave me something to focus on that wasn't myself and it gave me a reason to want to get better. We share a bit of a special bond. People say that she's just like me. I actually have ADHD. My brain works a little bit special. And Banksy shows some ADHD behaviours where she gets very distracted, she gets very energetic. Can I have my glasses, please? Thank you. Hey, it's a little girl. The bond between a mother bat and a baby bat is incredibly strong. Banksy suffered contact burns from her mother and she ended up losing too much of her wing to be able to be released. She has not forgotten who I am. She knows me, she knows my voice, and she doesn't act like she does with anybody else than she does with me. I rescue it my, out of my parents' home. <laughs> Thanks, Mum and Dad. The maximum number of animals that I've had in my house was 90. Gosh, my parents are going to kill me. <laughs> I'd gone my entire life not knowing anything about these animals. I had no idea that they were a threatened species and I had no idea that they were critically vital to the environment. That was quite profound because, you know, I was thinking, I wonder how many people wouldn't stop and think about a bat other than it's going to bite me and it's going to suck my blood. <laughs> That's what, what did it for me and it's just been one long road. <laughs> I was in a pretty low place and I just am grateful because I don't think I would have gotten out of that. I haven't really said that before but they've done so much for me and I want to do the best for them that I can possibly do. They deserve it, they need it. Are you done?